Mikhail Podolyak, the war will cross over to Russia. This is an objective, historical process. Mikhail Podolyak, advisor to the head of the president's office of Ukraine, spoke about the risk of the Russians blowing up the Zaporozhye nuclear power plant, the collapse of Russia, Prigozhin and the Russian opposition, joining NATO and security guarantees, the impossibility of negotiations with the aggressor, the counter-offensive and the next winter. He spoke about it in an interview with RBC Ukraine in June, Ukraine finally launched a long-awaited counter-offensive. Frightened Russians responded asymmetrically by blowing up the Kharkovskaya hydroelectric power station and provoking one of the largest man-made disasters of recent times. However, the world reacted to this rather sluggishly. Even Ukraine's Western allies avoided any specifics from the very beginning. According to Mikhail Podolyak, the reason for this is the unwillingness of the world, even in the second year of the war, to call white white and black black and accordingly fix the status of Russia as a terrorist country with the corresponding consequences. And in general, during the conversation, Podolyak spoke rather critically about the Western allies of Ukraine, their excessive caution, conservatism and fearfulness. As for Russia, Podolyak is even more categorical. The process of the destruction of the empire is irreversible and soon chaos awaits it, which will eventually end with a return to 1991 with relative democratization and a radical decrease in Russia's role in the world. Therefore, any negotiations with the Russian Federation at this stage are simply excluded. And while Ukraine faces many more trials, the fights must go on. This is a huge ideological war. And here it can only be like this. One country won, the other lost. There is no middle ground here. In the middle, for Ukraine, this means that we lost, says Podolyak. He said that the war will cross over to Russia. This is an objective, historical process.